Howdy folks, welcome back to my channel. Feeling a bit better today. A few days ago I posted a video and I said, hey, this is my first post-COVID video and I started, you know, trying to get back to regular life and, and uh, COVID showed me <laughs> that it was still hanging on and uh, I might have tried to get back too soon because I spent the last couple of days back in bed. But uh, that said, I'm not gonna jinx myself, but uh, I'm hoping the worst is behind me at this point. But today, I want to share a cool, super cool item with you guys right here. This is a Lel Rototom RT, and it was built in uh, the USSR back in the 80s during Cold War. And this is actually my Christmas present from my wife. Before I get into it, and you're probably saying, wait, Christmas, it's more like Valentine's Day now. Why is this a Christmas present? Well, she ordered it from the Ukraine. Um, and she ordered it back in December, hoping that it would be here by Christmas. And it got lost in a black hole somewhere and it just disappeared off the place, face of the planet for like six weeks. They couldn't find it. Finally, they found it and then they got it moving again. And uh, it just, <laughs> just arrived whilst I was sick. So I haven't uh, had a chance to do a video on this yet, but here it is. So I do not read Russian. As you can see, all the controls are in Russian, but I used a translator app. And according to the translator app, these three controls across the top, you see there are three controls. And this one is tone, this one is timbre, and this one is fall. And I'm going to associate fall with decay because, you know, we would think of rise fall as attack decay. So I think this is the decay, the timbre, and the tone. Right here, maybe you can just kind of see that there is uh, some lettering there that says out. So this is the output. And it does look like a pedal, but you notice there's no input. And that's because it's not a pedal. It's actually something else. We'll get to some sound demos in just a second. Um, on the back, there's also some Russian writing. And again, I used a translator app to translate this. I'll spare you all the details because most of it is like patent numbers or, you know, complies to kind of stuff. But the important part here is there is a date of manufacture. This says date of manufacture. And then right next to it is written 0589. So I'm assuming this was made in May of 1989. I would have probably been in, in uh, junior high at that time or something. And then, of course, it uses a standard nine volt battery and so what is this if it's not an effect pedal what is it this is a drum synthesizer so the idea is it has like a little spring in there and you can kind of feel it if you tap it and you hit this pad right here with a drum stick and then you change these controls and you can get all matters of different drum sounds out of this and Lel is a company that was based, as I mentioned before, in the Soviet Union, and they made two of these. This one is called the Rototom, and it's green, and they made another one that's blue, and it's called the Clapper. And the Rototom had the lower-pitched um, tones to it, and the Clapper had the higher-pitched tones to it, but they both work very similarly. Maybe someday I'll find a Clapper. But um, in any case, this is a super cool piece of Cold War tech, and I'm really happy to share this with you today. So let's see what this thing can do and do a few sound samples.
there you have it, folks. A quick video about my belated Christmas present. Uh, so cool. And thank you, honey, for, for finding this. This is super cool. And by the way, I found a few of these just cool random kind of pawn shop or eBay kind of finds. And so I created a playlist called Cool Finds. I'll link that in the description if you want to check that out and see some of the other things. And hopefully I'll find more and keep adding to that playlist over the uh, coming years. But anyway, that's going to wrap up today's video again i know i said this in the last video but thanks to everyone who, who who sent the positive vibes my way i really do appreciate it and thank you for tuning in today if you like what i do on this channel i'd really appreciate it if you would hit that subscribe button and if you like the video please give it a big old thumbs up for me and i'll see you guys soon